we can take a few hits. So we're going to do a little bit less running and a little more thumping. Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days to Dine Alpha 20. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to go uh, do the opening trade routes quest first. We do have a bicycle now, um, and it's only one uh, a little before 1 o'clock on the same day as the last episode. Uh, so let's eat one of these just to top off our food. We're in actually pretty good shape on food, and we still have uh, two more lamb cuts in there. Let's take... Um, uh, oh, shoot, I didn't mean to do that. I meant, I want to take a red tea to make the food last longer is what I meant to do. But now we're going to be plenty well hydrated, so we're good to go there. And, yeah, let's... Um, oh, one other thing I wanted to do. Now that we have a bicycle and we can get away from monsters quicker, um, we could start wearing armor. So we've got... We would need the legs and the boots, which we could make... I don't think we need any special perks for that. Uh, so we're just going to need scrap iron, leather, and duct tape. Um, yeah, so let's let's get that done first, assuming I have enough scrap iron. Oh, yeah, we should have enough scrap iron to do that. So let's make the hands and the boots. And we already have all the other pieces right here. And we'll start wearing armor. It's going to make us tougher uh, because we no longer need to worry about outrunning zombies. Uh, we're going to be able to just get away from them on the bike from now on. And, uh, yeah, so we should be good to go to, Good to go there. So wear that, wear this, and we want to put this back on our other thing. Wear those, go here, modify, and put that on. I don't, do we? I don't think we have any more mods. I forgot to sell some stuff from the trader in the last episode, too. I was noticing that after I left you guys, so... Uh, let's grab that and that and the light. And I think we're going to hang on to everything else. That doesn't go in there. Well, let's put this in here. Okay. So we'll we'll just sell our crap armor to him too. Well, that one's... We're just going to scrap that. Um, this we'll scrap too. These are worth definitely worth selling. And the rest of the stuff we'll sell. We'll get five coin for that, but you know, five coin is five coin. Well, actually, here, can we repair this? Yeah, we'll use that cloth to repair it, and that makes it 31. Um, can we repair this with plastic, or do we need a repair kit? I don't want to burn a repair kit on this. Pretty sure we need a repair kit for that. Let's take all of our repair kits and put them in here. Yeah. Uh, where's the plastic? Yeah. Okay, we're going to sell it as it is. I, I don't want to burn a repair kit for that. We're just not it's not going to be worth it. We're not going to get that much money from it if we if we fix it first. Okay, we'll put the duct tape and the iron back in there and I think we're in pretty good shape. Oh, and the plastic too. We don't need to take that with us. We should pick up some wood while we're out and about too. And I think we're good to go. All right, let's do it. So we are definitely moving slower now, but that's to be expected with heavy armor on. But we're also going to be able to take some more hits. So it's an it's a trade-off, you know? <coughs> Excuse me. So let's go back over the trader real quick. We gotta go that direction anyway, and we'll sell this extra stuff to him. And then we gotta head 1.6 kilometers over to the next trader, which is a trader gin. That's gonna open up another town for us, I'm I'm assuming too, in the process. I think it's the same day, right? So he's not gonna, yeah, he's not gonna have any more food in there, so that's fine. I did put, uh, we had an extra point, and I put that into pain tolerance, too, by the way, guys. Just so you know. All right, let's sell this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this. There we go. Okay, that gets us up the, well, actually, I left my coin back at the base. I should have should have brought it with me, but that's enough to buy several cans of food if we do come across it uh, at the next trade. Well, shoot. No, let's go get the money. We got the bike now, so it won't take that long. And I'll keep the money in the bike. All right, I'm going to get back on this main road and follow it um, north until it starts to veer off from the direction we need to go and see if uh, this road actually leads to that town. Where'd that rabbit go? Okay, there's a chicken. 
Um, so let's... I want to kill that chicken. All right, she's dead. Um, where did the chicken go? All right, there's a rabbit way down there. That's a long ways away. Hey, we got it. Look at that. <laughs> I thought we saw a chicken, though, too. Um. Okay, let's go. <laughs> oh, there's the chicken. There's the chicken. Okay, let's stop and get this rabbit. And hopefully we can stay ahead of the pig until it de-aggros, and then we'll take another cheap shot at it. Okay, yeah. There's another chicken. Goodness gracious. Chicken's all over the place. There's too much too much game around here. I don't want to pass it up. Okay. Okay, we got the chicken. Let's go butcher it, and then we'll go back and see if we can circle back and na nail that pig. Okay, let's go back this way. See if we can spot Piggly Wiggly. Oh, there's the other chicken, too. All right, this is just like hunting day, man. Okay, he did. Okay, another headshot. And then run away. Ooh, you're not happy with us. I'm starting to think my heavy armor affects my stamina usage on the bike, too. It kind of seems like it. If that's the case, maybe we should take it off while we're traveling on the bike. Okay, is he still chasing us? See if we can get a couple of shots off before we run away like a chicken old guy. Why did you have to run in front of the car so I couldn't get a direct line of sight shot on you, man? Okay, time to go. He's angry. Dudes are tough, man. See, I would not have attempted this without the bike. <laughs> that pig would wreck us. Uh, can we get one more shot off? We got him. Okay. Nice. Got 30 chunks of meat out of that deal. I'll take it. All right. Let's store a couple things in the bike before we continue on. Pretty much all that stuff. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to take my armor off. No, not my clothes. You guys don't want to see that anyway. And let's just, well, let's just keep it on our, our person for now. Because, you know, as long as I don't get in a scrap or anything, we don't really need to wear it while we're on the bike. <clears throat> okay, let's stop, get a little stamina back. There's another chicken down the road, too. Look at me. <laughs> What's my stove in my mouth? All right. <clears throat> Unfortunately, we got Bo chasing us, so getting that chicken's not safe. Unless we can pull over here. I think we scared it off, though, is the thing. But here, let's just bring this back out anyway. Nope, he's right down there. Excellent. And a rabbit. Man, this is just hunting day, man. For a minute there, I thought I actually got him on the move. Wait till he stops. We got the quest marker thing right in the way. There we go. 
Okay, let's get the chicken first, because we killed it first, then we'll get the rabbit. And we got somebody's attention. Okay. Man, we are going to come home with a pile of meat. It's going to be great. We got Nurse Ratchet's attention. Oh, don't hit. Oh, shit. We don't have our armor on. I want to lead her away from the chicken so we can harvest it. Look at that. 90 pieces of meat, man. That is awesome. We will buy this, and this, and this, and this. Beautiful. You again. Well, that didn't take long. Nice work. All right, let's take a look at Jen's inventory. Pipe shotgun, pipe pistol, fishing, fish taco recipe. Iron helmet, okay. Uh, let's look at this. Got a nice hunting knife, but that's still too expensive for us right now. And then I'm just looking at normal stash. Um, I wouldn't mind having some of these, but I don't know. 216 is a lot of a lot of bank right now. A lot of bank for us right now. So I think that's uh, all we're gonna get from her. I'm not gonna oh, are you actually. Soon? Yeah, I'm leaving. I'm not going to actually take any quests from her because she's a little far away from our base. We'll just keep questing with um, Trader Joel. But let's do the usual looting session here. And we'll just sell back to her everything that we loot unless it's something we want to keep, of course. Oh, nice. Not as nice as what we have on, though. All right, let's take a look at your inventory. I will sell you as many of those as you'll buy, which is, that's it. We're getting rid of those. We'll sell you those. We'll sell you these. And this. And these. And I think that's... Oh, we're gonna sell it. We want to keep the rest of this stuff. Okay. Remember me if you need medical supplies. All right, let's eat this now because we need to, and it'll free up another slot. And let's drink this now too, for the same reason. I'm gonna chuck that. I don't think she'll buy one jar, will she? For for one coin. Okay. Well, hey, there you go. It's better than throwing it away, I suppose. Will she buy this? Thanks All for right. the business. You're welcome. We're open from dawn to dusk. Since, you know, we don't have clocks. You don't have clocks, right. Okay, let's fall my nose. We're going to just jump on a bike and get the hell out of here because it's a little hot right now. Now, when we go back to our town, I don't know if uh, Trader Joe will have tier twos for us or not but if he doesn't that's fine we'll just wait it, it's getting pretty late in the day anyways and we'll just wait till tomorrow and then take those quests from him so we'll come back here i'm sure we'll come back here later um and do some more exploring of this town uh, but we still have a lot of our our current town that we haven't fully explored yet either so i think i'm gonna just uh, head back to the base. I'm going to stop and harvest gut piles, loot cars, trash, every, all that stuff along the way. And then um, I'll probably hang out at the base tonight, maybe do a little bit of mining. And then tomorrow morning, we will uh, get started with our first Tier 2 quest. So I'll see you guys in the morning.
All right, guys, welcome back. It is morning, and uh, so I spent uh, the first part of the night chopping trees down on the bicycle and then replanted some trees around the perimeter of the yard and then spent the majority of the night mining um, down almost all the way down to bedrock. And so we have quite a bit of stone here. Uh, made a bunch of jars in here and have those most of those jars being cooked up right now as boiled water, and I saved 20 in here for making glue later on as needed. Okay, so we're in pretty good shape uh, food food wise. Um, I still have uh, 31 pieces of meat in here and then we have a, a couple of pieces of boiled meat. Uh, so let's eat three of those in total and then uh, we're going to hang on to the rest of those. And what we're going to do now is we're going to go check the vending machine uh, down by the donut shop first and then hopefully it will be pretty close to time for the trader to open up. And at that point, we can get our next quest, okay? So let's grab the money out of here, and we're just going to take the bike uh, down to the donut shop. Let's do that first. You can see that I have new trees planted <coughs> excuse me, around the perimeter of the yard here uh, for more logging later on. And yeah, so let's head on down the street here. We'll go get the donut shop, get whatever canned food we can get out of the vending machine there, and then head up towards the trader. Okay, let's see what we got here. So we got some sham, yucca, two more lamb and la uh, rations, and some miso. Nice, not too bad. Okay, cool. Let's head over by up to the trader and wait for him to open up. Maybe I'll hit a couple of these along the way. Nice, what's this do for us? Increase attack speed by 10%, okay? Probably won't be using spares anymore, but you never know. That will sell. Okay. Um, these should be exactly the same, which they are. That's enough lead that'll probably go ahead and take it and drop it off back at the house there. Okay, let's see what this vending machine has. Uh, we got some chili and some dog food. And I don't think I'll take any of the rest of that stuff. Not for now, anyway. All right, let's get our first Tier 2 quest, guys. Let us visit for a while. After we sell this. And this. I don't think we need two of these. It's been a real pleasure. You All right, here we go. Out there. Uh, we got the night only restore power. We will be doing those, but probably not in immediately. Uh, let's start off with hmm, berry supplies. Yeah, we can't do berry supplies. <laughs> I just don't think that's gonna happen. Not until I'm like really decked out in high-end armor and weapons because of the way they work now. Um, the fetch is probably going to be the most feasible one to do. So let's help me with my problem? let's go ahead and, and do a fetch for our very first run around here. Um, let's take a look and see what he's got for food too. Uh, okay, food. He doesn't have anything for food. Do you have anything in here that we we want? He's got a couple forty-four magnums, but they're just a bit expensive for us right now. Just a little bit on the expensive side, man. Okay, I Thanks think we're good. Anyways, you be careful out there. All right, we'll see you, Joel. Okay, let's go drop a couple things off at the base, and then we're going to head out to our first Tier 2 quest. All right, I think we have a problem. Um, I can't find the damn rally point for this quest. It's like, okay, 5.1, 4.7, 4.3, 4.2... 4-4, four, 4-4, four. Four, four. Four, 1 four, three. It's like it's supposed to be right about here-ish, which doesn't make sense because it's right in the middle of the road. And, yeah, uh, I think something's broken here, ladies and gentlemen. It's supposed to be a ranch house, so I'm guessing it's this place. But I can't activate the rally point. What the hell, man? Head to house old ranch five and retrieve the shipment. Oh shit. Okay, well, uh, we can't do it if we can't activate the quest. That's really disappointing. <laughs> it's supposed to be four three six four four point four four point nine. 
four three is about as close as I can get to it. Is it underground? Four two, four seven. I mean, what the hell? Seriously? Let's just see. Yeah, the further I dig down, the further away I get from it. Point six. Okay, well, um, I think it's jacked up. Oh, well, no, I don't think it's jacked up. I know it's jacked up, but we gave it a try, I guess. All right, let's just do the house. Where are we supposed to go in it? I think it's over on this side. It was a bow zombie. It looks like there's a horde over that way. Don't know where they're planning on going, though. Okay. He's a little close for my comfort, so we better deal with him. We can take a few hits, so... We're going to do a little bit less running and a little more thumping moving forward here. Oh, nice bow upgrade. Okay, we'll take that. Um, we'll just scrap both of those. And load up the iron. Okay, I also would like to get... This cobblestone. Oh shit, that scared me. We got two of you, huh? Okay, he did. If you're gonna be stupid, yeah, he's not gonna be stupid now. He did. Uh, don't want that. That is not lootable. Yeah, we'll take the brass, sure. Let's just consume these right now. take that okay I think that's it for in here let's proceed Zombos? oh he dead we smacked him down, did didn't we? All right, anybody in here? Okay, we're good. Nothing up there. There's a trash up here. Not taking that. Uh, not taking that stuff either. Okay. Loot in the ceiling at all? Yes, there's a duffel bag right here. Oh, nice. Very nice. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah. That was some good loot there, you guys. I'll take it. I will take it. Uh, that and that. Don't need these. Very easily made back at the base. Sweet! We got a really nice pipe rifle upgrade there. Really nice. Alright. We got a party going on here. Let's get him bled up. Fantastic. And we can... 
uh, repair those and take them with us. I think that's going to be it for downstairs for Zombos. Is there like another room back there? It looks like it. Let's get the leather from this. Couple of lock picks. I'll take those. Got somebody's attention. Off with his head. Let's keep that repaired. Because now we got someone else. Oh, they're not coming this way, though. They're coming up above what we're gonna do here is put up a temporary barrier from anything coming that way okay and then let's loot in here Okay, I think that's all we can loot in here. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. Um, we'll keep everything else. All right. Let's deal with these zombos here. Over here. Come get me, darling. Darlene's not quite able to get around the the rail there. We can't really get to her either, so let's check and see what's in here. I'll take that. Okay, well, I guess we won't worry about her for now, and we'll continue on. Make sure everybody's loaded here, because we might get rushed in, in this place. But we're going to have to take these down now. Or at least one of them. Poke our head around the corner. Okay, more than likely, there's a Zeke in here. Or not. Got somebody else's attention, though. Up above there, probably. Turn our light off for a second. Yeah, there's a Zeke up here. Okay. Um. Turn all of these into scrap. That's a Ronnie McDonnie. I want to block off this area and close that door. Oh, oh, there's two Zeeks up there. All right, can we get by them and get inside of here? I guess not. Didn't get that up in time. Okay. Run downstairs. Put the light on so I can see what I'm doing. Uh, go. Oh, shit. Go this way. There we go. All right. We got this. Hopefully nobody comes from elsewhere. We'll close those doors. Oh, we got two skill points. Yeah, we're going to have to do something about that. Oh, Darlene, you finally got through. Unless you're a new Darlene. Okay, let's get this repaired. Need a little stamina action here. Okay, she's dead. And now we got something going on here. 
Edgar. What's up, buddy? Really kind of irks me that we're not getting credit for this quest, but... Whatever. We're getting XP. We're going to get fat loots. You know, when the time comes, so... It's the best we can do under the circumstances. Let's go back up here. So, huh? That must have been a different Darlene. Okay. These aren't really doing us any good over here, so let's pick them up now. Uh, let's get the leather. Okay, so what's going on in here? Oh, shit. Okay. More dropping from the ceiling shenanigans. There's a lot of that going on in Alpha 20. Oh, he... Wow. He broke through. I wasn't even paying attention, obviously. Okay, so he came from up above there. Let's go into this room. Probably in there. Yep, there is a bow zombo in there. Yeah, we must have thumped him good. Okay, let's close that door. A little purse action up here. Dollar dollar bills, y'all. Yeah, we'll take the sewing kit. Nothing behind there. We got a bookcase. Uh, nice. I don't mind if I do. Go back to the base and see if we have the parts to make that. I don't know if we will or not. One piece. Oh, we found the fat loot room. Nice. Uh, we're going to need one piece of stone to repair our axe. Oh, shit. There's a dog right there. Crap. All right. Got him right in the noggin. No, that's not what I want to do. Get that out of the way. There we go. Okay. I think I'm going to upgrade this just because we got... A lot of nastiness going on there. All right, time to bleed, guys. Okay, we got her done. I'm gonna break this out. It's gonna wait. Be much easier than breaking out the cobblestone. And shit. Okay. We need a stone, man. There we go. Okay. Okay, we got an ammo pile here. Oh, shit. Sneaky, sneaky. All right, weapons bag. Let's do that first. Some Molotovs. Okay, that's always good. Crack a book. Uh, we'll learn that, and we'll... Yeah, what the hell, we'll learn that. And fat loots. Okay, we got an upgrade for our leg armor. I mean, for our feet armor. Feet armor? So that's pretty good. And we got some crossbow bolts for later on when we eventually get a crossbow. And that is it. Uh, again, it's, it's a shame that we couldn't actually do the quest properly, but I guess that's just the way it goes, eh? So um, I'll, I'm going to just cancel that quest. And we'll go back to the trader and we'll get 
Uh, we'll try a new one. Uh, so I'll meet you guys. I'm going to stop at the house, drop some things off, and I'll meet you guys at the trader. All right, guys, we have taken the next quest from the trader, and fortunately, we do have the quest marker here. Unfortunately, however, we are out of time in this episode. I didn't realize <laughs> how far um, how, how far time has gotten away from us. And so uh, we're going to go ahead and wrap it up here, and then I'm going to start the next episode, and we're going to... We're going to start right at this exact point here. So it'll just be a couple seconds um, for for me, for you guys. Though, of course, it'll be the next episode. So, all right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video and we'll catch you the next one. Bye bye.